thing you look at you look on the roster of teams at the showdown you look at big you think okay, that's a team that could actually make it all the way through but ooh, nice start qb taking down tabson running block right to the face and it's a four on five to begin with here first half is or first half of the map here is already underway skrunk taking a little bit of a look while they're bringing the bomb up they're not even slowing it down slight fake just to see if there's going to be a reaction there are sometimes double or triple nades set up here running through though and those flashes are not helping out the ct side at all they get wiped out Searson is on his own trying to backtrack that one i like the little fake plant just to bait out some nades yeah that is that is a very necessary step in planting the bomb and we saw that big obviously didn't have any grenades but what I didn't love about that from Big is how disconnected it felt. There was a flash, and we only see two of the four players. Oh, nice smoke. That'll, that is going to be tough for Singhal to deal with. As long as Sin doesn't peek it. Oh, no. That is a poor understanding of where that smoke lands from Sin. Maybe Krimbo didn't actually hit the smoke perfectly there, but that is an, a free entry into the bomb site. This is going to be impossible to defend for Krimbo now. And... He's just pushing through. What? Yeah, he wants to oh, be the what? hero, and he will be huge. Double. He almost had that last one on Skrunk as well. Some flames touching Sis, and he's going to come charging through. Wanted to stop the bomb. There's only five seconds. If he had, that might have been the round one, or it would have been. Tabson, though, showing up with the headshots, and I don't even know understand how, but somehow it's a one versus two in favor of Big here. Corey back listening for that bomb defuse. It's a 10 second defuse as well, so it's gonna be a long time still. Five seconds on it. He's running out of bullets. Oh, oh. nice headshot. And Tabson, he's gonna spin around for it, even though they'll throw it at you. Right in the face. Hey, if that's what if that's what it takes, if that works, then why not? He had the right idea. He kind of was pre-aiming that position, I think, earlier. Sin able to defeat him with the AK. Now it's just a shooting gallery here. Citizen joining in. Still hasn't been able to afford that AWP, but oh, he's doing good work. Yeah, clean stuff from him. I, we're starting to see actually a lot of oppers choose to use the A1S, especially on Vertigo. Uh, Zaiwu is probably the he's leading the charge in terms of uh, he he built almost just doesn't op anymore on Vertigo on CT side. He just he just likes having the A1. To find out here. Blank absolutely found by Soulfly. Yeah, no strong plan being shown by Big in this one, but just taking the duels. Okay, that's the bomb. That's interesting. Because Skrunk has 19 HP, and Tapson has a chance to take an AK into this. That is massive. Okay, one on one situation, but Corey is right behind him. Yeah, there's no way Tapson knows. There's no way he's gonna check this. 25 seconds though, and the problem is for Corey, eventually, if he has to start to make noise, then. The element of surprise is going to be on. I can't believe Tabson's even in this round. Oh. He should have been lost. Oh, he's going to go oh. up middle. This is absolutely sick. Now Corey is the one lacking the information. Where is Tabson going to be going? Surely back through the middle. Yeah, 10 seconds. He has a Molotov. If he was really sick, he'd bounce it off and land. But that may be too much. Had to give up the position as well. Sneaking in now. Looking for it, Corey, though. The pre-fire was there. He had the right idea. Another clutch from Corey. Okay. Tapson calls his own number this time. Swings on down. Can't really see through the fire very well, though. And so Soulfly takes him down from the side. That's a bit unfortunate. And okay. Nice wall bang from Sursen. Fozy not even standing a chance in that engagement. He was <laughs> so confident in shot. I actually, for a minute, thought Fozy was on the other side of the wall. I thought he was <laughs> like, is he just out in the open? My god. Sin, a lot of damage on the Soulfly. Flash in to take a peek at. Once again, they're all down there, so you got to be careful. Here's a second pop flash. He's going to swing, and it's the entire team. What a spray. Skrunk nearly dead. That is almost a triple. Krimbo and Keto, that's a deadly combination. An exchange of mollies now. Skrunk, he's going to peek behind his. Krimbo is ready for it. He's seen that trick before, which leaves Fozy and Corey right here at the ramp, spotted by Sursen. Now just Fozy. He's aware of the player positions on big, but he has so many fights that he has to win. Oh, there's one, and nope, it will be Sursen that takes him down. Op v op to close things out. Right there, it's definitely on here. Nine to six in the first half. Second half is coming right up. 
And this is to stay in the tournament. This is for the tournament life right at the moment. Nice sneaky kill. Kido opening up with a double clock and nearly finding a third. Look at the tags. He is just wrecking this mid defense. There was four people here and now they're running away from him. Oh, he's doing everything. Getting the assist on the last one. Nearly a quad kill on Kido. That is beautiful. There is a panic amongst Sangal now. They are scattering. They're trying to find where they need to be rotating. But it looks like Big are in firm control. They're, they're reading them. Big, Big's... Big knows what's going on right now, and it's Sangal that's playing catch up. Yeah, they're getting picked apart from the inside out. It almost feels like Krimbo infiltrating the lineup, and Sin will get the last couple of kills here. That is Sangal. If they lose this round, they might have nothing left to fight with at the end of it. It'd surely be heartbreaking given how well they played. Soulfly return opening, getting that one, and he's going to pick it up on Kido as well. Out in the open, Corey. If you get pump flashed here, you're probably just going to be dead, but he's going to get the kill and just make a retreat. Attempt at a return from Tapson, but that's a thing, but he could maybe find the first kill. Tapson's bumping into him. He can't see a thing. And somehow the CTs come out on top. Wow. Chaos all around. Yeah, I can't believe Scrum pushed down. Oh, nice shot by Cersei in there. That is quick, but he can't find two return kills. Sin with the boost, though. This is an opportunity. QB, oh, he doesn't know that this player is here. And Sin now, he spotted the shadow out. Three on three. Corey defending with a CZ towards B. If he falls, this B is ripe for the taking. He's up close, and he needs to nail every bullet. Yeah, Foz is coming up behind him, so might be a little bit of a chance. There's the opening. MP9 right on time. Couldn't have been better. Krimbo back here, but he doesn't want to shoot through too much. He's picked up the AK. And there's another kill for Fozzy. The MP9 doing God's work in this round. Searson on his own. One versus two. Missing a couple of shots. And they're right next to him in the smoke. He has got no way to know. He actually turned around for it, but still going to get shot in the back. Man. If they have the right flashbang at the right corner here, then Corey could be in a lot of trouble. Even if he's got some backup behind him, you've got to be real careful here. They're thinking about it. Setting it up. There's the flash shot over, but it's pretty easy to dodge. Corey comes back in with a pretty decent spray and tabs and burning behind that Molotov. QB's going to be ready for this follow-up. Kind of running out of bullets. It's a bit awkward, but um, still trying the best that he can. Sin will take him down. Bomb is lost, though, and it's a one versus three. Yeah, pistols back out. There's no more bullets in that one. And Soulfly will get the final kill. So 50. With a couple more people in middle here. Spray not quite connecting. Skrunk on the one side, Corey on the other, and they're going to become charging through. They jump right over. He almost has the perfect tracking in the middle. Yeah, Searson, though, picking up two kills in return. And now it's a three on three. Nobody on the bomb side. The bomb, though, not making its way there. The HE onto Searson. And now they're in trouble. Sin, one versus three. And that smoke, it's just making his life hell. Scrug will take him down. It's overtime. 15 15. As Sangal find a way to this. They're looking at it. They know Scrunk could be here. Timing is everything. He's got some teammates showing up on the other side. Oh, this could work. Sankal, they're showing up. They're taking all the attention. Scrunk walking up behind them, and it's a beautiful triple spray down. Rocking big in this round. Keto, no chance there. And Searson surely confused. A two what? for one nade. Eight seconds left, but the bomb is too far. He can't win the round. He could try, but it's going to be too late. Soulfly with the last one. Oh, my God. <laughs> Three seconds. A lot of people on the other side. Deep Molotov as well, but he's hiding maybe a good position for him. He overpeaks it just a tiny bit, and they knock out Krimpo. Oh, dear. Two versus four, and just 10 seconds on the clock. They're going to go straight for the bomb plant and not going to be denied either. Keto and Tabson in a lot of trouble, holding on to Beak's tournament life in this one. And Keto just trying to hope in the edge shot, but he'd love to find a free kill. They need that right now, but they're not going to be allowed to get it either. Skrunk takes down one, and Tabson is now in a dreadful one versus three. They know where he is, and they're all ready to fight him. 19-16, and Sangal, absolute huge upset, and taking down big. That is a massive win for Sangal here to get it done on Inferno and to go 